Hi. Well, you know we love local history here at Cincy Lifestyle. And located at the corner of Tobacco and Electric Alleys in Covington, Kentucky, is a former pickle factory that's now home to a boutique hotel with fun themed rooms, six of them. I recently stopped by to see what makes the Pickle Factory Hotel such a big deal. This is the Pickle Factory Boutique Hotel. The building has had multiple different uses throughout its history. It was built in 1873. It was originally built by Henry Wenzel and he operated a soda manufacturing. It was mineral water is what they called it in the 1800s, which was basically what we call soda today. And uh, so he operated that and then from there it transitioned into a pickle jarring facility. So as we were thinking of names, we thought, well, we could either call it uh, you know, something that had to do with soda factory apartments or pickle factory apartments and pickles one. The idea that our interior designer had imagining what Henry Wenzel, the original builder of the building, would have left work to go home to. And so it's got a very aristocratic, historic uh, vibe, if you will, when you walk in. It, it, in some ways it feels like upscale Sherlock Holmes. There's, there's lots of antique, really cool features. And then the next room is called Soda Pop. And of course that's based off of the soda manufacturing facility and it's super fun, bright colors, pinks, blue, big circles on the wall, the light fixtures look like bubbles and it's a really unique space. Moving down to this room that we're in right now, uh, it's Cigars and Bourbon. One of the alleys that runs alongside this building is Tobacco Alley and so we thought you know it'd be fun to incorporate tobacco, so cigars and bourbon. So this is a very kind of Kentucky bourbon themed room. And then going upstairs, uh, we have uh, the uh, pickle jar apartment, which is basically our pickle themed units. And of course, green walls, green ceilings, green furniture. It's, it's a really bold unit, but it's, it's a lot of fun. And then from there, neon, lots of neon lights, very bold electric vibes. And that is based off of our other alley that runs alongside this building's electric alley. And so we wanted to incorporate that into the interior design. And then lastly, we have uh, our Odd Fellows themed room, which of course the Odd Fellows was a fraternal organization similar to the Freemasons in the 1800s. And this building was actually home to the African American Odd Fellows group. And so we wanted to be able to nod to that piece of African American history in Covington. And so it's all themed after the Odd Fellows. The spaces that you build have to be what I would call Instagram worthy. Would I want to book this place so that I could take pictures of myself in that place and brag to all of my friends? And if that criteria is not met, then people aren't going to book your space. And so all of our spaces are designed in such a way to just be aesthetically pleasing, these really interesting spaces. And because of that, we've had a ton of interest from Instagram influencers and news outlets and things like that that just find the space really unique. You can check us out on Instagram or Facebook to be able to see our feed there. It's cool, we've kind of gotten to take our little corner of Tobacco and Electric Alley and, and add that to the mix of interesting things that people can come and stay and experience.